So if you need to measure LUFs in Logic Pro, we have something called the loudness meter right here. Now to find this, we can go into our usual menu for an effects plugin. We've got metering, and then we want to pick up the loudness meter here. And that's going to open up this for us. It's very simple to use. We have this little adjustment here. This gives us a nice easy LUFs target. So if we're say pushing for something at minus nine LUFs, or that's the target we want to go for, then we can just set that and when it goes yellow rather than blue, we've hit that target. Another thing is when we first use it, we'll have start and reset and there'll be nothing here. When we press play, we've got our momentary and our short. But integrated doesn't show up whatsoever. We need to press start and that's gonna activate integrated for us. And as we can see, we're now hitting that measurement. Now, if we need to measure the entirety of a project, what we'd need to do with this particular meter is select the entire project and have it play through from the beginning. And that's gonna give us the integrated LUFs across the entire project. One thing you can do if you're able to bounce your track faster than it would play through, we can in fact just do Command and B, bounce the track out and it will still give us our final integrated result. As you can see here, it still gives the real time reading while the track is being bounced out. So this can be a much quicker way to get your integrated LUFS result if you so want to use that, as it's much faster than playing the track back in real time. Here we'd be playing back four minutes or so, and this has taken only a few seconds. I hope that's been helpful, and that is how you would measure LUFS inside Logic Pro.